Hello everyone, welcome back to Stalker Lost Alpha. I took some time before the start of this episode to go sell every single thing that I didn't want to Petranko. And as a result of that, I have just enough money to do what I want. And what I want is to buy a damn exoskeleton suit. Unfortunately, to actually afford that, I had to sell my old armor, which is why I'm wearing nothing but a sweater and some jeans. But don't worry, that'll be rectified in just a second. So, an exoskeleton costs 100,000. I have 110,000. I also spent a little bit of money on repairing my GP37, which was actually at 79%. Um, 79% durability, basically. So, repaired that up. I also upgraded it, because as it turns out, I actually did not fully upgrade it. There was one last upgrade I could make. It was either the, the recoil or the improved accuracy. So I went ahead and improved the accuracy by, I believe it was 14%. And that cost about 4,000, so not too much. So, repaired my weapon, upgraded my weapon, and now we are about to experience the exoskeleton. Hey, buddy. All right, you better still sell this damn thing. Oh, there it is. I can't wait to have that in my arms. I'm gonna love you tenderly. I'm gonna polish you every day. But uh, first, let's take a look at these. Make sure I'm not doing something stupid. What was the difference between these two? I think it's the weight, right? This one's slightly more expensive, but it weighs less. But it's also significantly not as good. Yeah, the rupture protection of this thing is 50%. The rupture protection of this thing is 80%. That is night and day. That is not worth it. Not for a little bit less weight. Not at all. Okay. Here we go. I'm gonna buy an exoskeleton suit. Oh, that thing is fucking beautiful. <gasps> it's mine now. Hold on, let's get a look at ourselves. Oh my god, don't we look like a fancy mofo? Hell yeah. Look like I'm half mech. Sweet. Beautiful. That is so awesome. That's gonna make me practically indestructible to bullets and monsters. Unfortunately though, it is significantly worse than my old suit in terms of anomalies, so anomalies are definitely going to be still an issue, especially radiation. Which, well, that's not really an anomaly, but still. Yeah, 30% protection is pretty crap. But that's okay, I got plenty of anti-rad meds. So let's spend what little money I have left on some ammo if I can. Because I kind of need it, especially AP. Yeah, let's get all the armor piercing. And... I'll get a little bit of standard. A little bit. Alright, it's time for some adventuring, so it's time to go to yet another lab. Yes, I know. Another lab. There's more and more and more and more of them. Lab Simulator 2014. Can I please sprint? Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Shit. Fuck. <laughs> You know what, I think it was a thing in Call of Pripyat, where the exoskeletons, you can't run with the exoskeleton suit unless you get an upgrade. I don't remember if the exoskeleton suit even existed in the original Stalker, but regardless, it obviously does now in Lost Alpha. And uh, apparently I can't run! Oh dear god, I really, 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 really hope that you can still get that upgrade, because if you can't, then... Holy shit, my combat effectiveness just went to, like, zero. I just out of curiosity, can I sell this thing back? Not that I want to, I, I do want it, if I can sprint. Nope! It'll only give me about one-third of what I paid for it. Okay. I guess I'm gonna go back to Petranko. 
I am so fucking sick of Petranko. Is there seriously nobody here who can actually repair stuff and tweak stuff? Alright, well, I don't feel like going back now. I'm gonna save that for some other time, because I just fucking went there. So, let's just go to the lab. I, I don't think I'm gonna need to sprint, especially if I'm so damn strong. At least not when I'm underground. So, let's just drive on over there. I want to shoot something. By the way, it took me a half Whoops. <laughs> um, it took me a half hour to go to Petranko and sell all my stuff and manage all that stuff. Yeah, I don't want to do that again. I'm done. I'm good. Kinda. Well, apparently not, since I need to go back to him to get that upgrade. Assuming the upgrade even exists, which I'm not sure. Man, if it doesn't exist, I'm gonna just, like... I don't even know. I'm so sick of traveling. Earthquake, come again! Yeah, there's an alternative camera for third person, by the way. There's actually two of them. There's this one, which is kind of locked down. And then there's this one, which is more freeform. So every bump, this camera moves up and down, as you can see. But with this one, it does not. But it does mean you can get some weird situations where you're looking at your car from the side, which can make it a little bit wonky to control. So one is easier to look at, and the other is easier to control. I think I'm going to stick with this one. It's a bit easier. What the hell? Oh, I ran out of gas. Remember, if your car randomly fishtails, that means you ran out of gas. Well, at least I, at least I look like a badass. That's what it's all about in the zone, isn't it? Pizzazz, the flash. Let's, uh, back this thing up. Alright, we're about to put this new suit to the test. Let's just run these over. There we go. Okay. You know, I'm just gonna shoot you. This thing does have night vision, right? Yes, it does. It's, it's not even the good night vision, either. Wonderful. Alright. Stop shooting my damn car. Hold on. Hold on, Stretch. You're fine, you're fine. There we go. Okay. Good thing is, with my upgraded weapon, um, as you can see, its accuracy is kinda amazing. Like, I'm pretty sure I could shoot a golf ball on the moon. Oh, I need to eat and drink. Hold on. Excuse me, please don't shoot me in the back while I'm eating and drinking. It's very rude. Um, I'll just have an energy drink. Okay. Y'all ready to die? Mm, too far away. Perhaps these weapons will be able to finance my upgrades for my suit. Which, thanks to the suit, I now have a vastly increased carry weight. 
Yep, canal carries 70 kilograms. Oh yeah, there's more of them. Excellent. I want all their weapons. I'm gonna put this suit to good use. I'm guessing they're all huddled around a campfire. Oh, there's one over here according to my map. These are military, right? Oh no, they're monolith. Wait, they're monolith. I thought the monolith was okay with me. Huh? I guess they hate me now. Okay. Oh, there's even more. Yes. Yeah, I guess I'll leave the night vision on. They huddled inside. Hmm. I think they are. And what do I have on my weapon? Oh shit. They're praying. God, I feel bad shooting them like this. Oh. I don't feel bad shooting them. Alright. I'm gonna use my grenades. Because that sounds like fun. If they're huddled together, are they? You're not huddled. He just went back to patrolling. Come on, we're gonna pop. We're gonna pop. I don't think I killed him, I think I stunned him. Let's <laughs> see if I can get this in the window. Nope! Run! Oh, I can't run. Knock, knock! That was a delayed reaction. I was wondering for a second if I could talk to him. Oh, I can't. Alright, there's still two left. Bro oh, yeah, yeah, those back there. Hmm. Do I kill them? No, let's be honorable. They didn't shoot at me. Could be special stuff in here. Probably not. Unfortunately, my experience with, uh, with Lost Alpha has taught me that exploration rarely yields anything worth a damn. Sometimes it does, but most of the time not. Alright, let's go to standard rounds. Probably mutants in here, if anything. gonna check my ammo. Yeah, I've got about 200 and actually no, I have exactly 221 standard rounds in my inventory not equipped. Not including the 60 or so I have on my belt. So, I should be fine on ammo. Okay. Let's disable this damn earthquake doomsday device. It's dooming up my day. Hmm. There's a non-hostile on the map. What the hell? Who be there? You! What? Oh my god. You look like me. What the hell? 
I'm a hypernetic security system. FATCON ID 163-28821 with integrated holo matrix defense against any threat or intruders in this area. Designate yourself. I'm just a stalker. I need to go through here to the main control room. Stay away from this area, stalker. You do not have security clearance. You can't come in. This is your first and final warning. But I need to. Stay right here. Oh, okay. Wait, wh where did you want me to stay? Here? 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 Everywhere? I'm confused. I feel like he's blaming me for something. Stop pointing at me. Jesus, you're making me nervous. Alright, well, you have a wonderful day. Goodbye. Don't try to shoot this hologram. It sends neural impulses directly to your brain. Cutting the stream will kill you. Run away. Okay. Well, I can't run, but... I'll walk. Oh, shit! I think he's coming after me. Uh... I think I better keep going. Hold on, this is the quest, right? Get through the security system. Yeah. I can't fucking run! I could take off my armor, but... Actually, then I'd be overloaded. Because I have over uh, 50 kilograms. That doesn't look passable. Um. This seems bad. Hi. I think it just killed me. Or not? Oh, it's doing damage, isn't it? I guess. Or giving me radiation? Something. Oh my god, you're a pathetic security system. Okay, so where can I go? Was there a doorway? Map is useless. Uh. Hmm. Science background. Override lock. I looked at the at the FADCON battle codes you sent to me. It's quite impressive, but are we sure it checks out in case of an emergency? Most of the programming code was written on ASM, but you sent me some source parts based on C sharp zero. What? Can I get the documentation too? It's quite hard to read code, which I don't fully understand. Hmm. Not sure how that helps. Other than there's some sort of a battle code that was sent to someone. Perhaps I should check another computer. Solitaire puzzle. Nothing in the recycling bin. Nothing in the DVD drive. Uh, nothing useful there. Oh, this is an exciting chase sequence. Alright, this looks promising. Unless this is where I came from. No. No, I don't think so. I'm glad he's so respectful of the fact that I can only waddle and I can't run. It's like, I have pity on you, I'm just gonna... run for a couple seconds to catch up to you and then just gently walk. Hmm. I don't think he can follow me up here. I don't think I could even fit up here. Please? Please? There we go. Uh. 
I'm just patiently waiting down there. Okay, I see stuff through the door in the top right corner, but I can't open it. Wonderful. Ah, uh, go away, radio. Copyrighted music, most likely. I can't see shit. Fucking hell. Am I going backwards? Oh, so I hear dogs. Doggies! Oh. What? I think maybe I shot him and that triggered the thingy? I don't even know what's happening anymore, to be honest. I'm like some action movie hero that's running through molasses away from my antagonist. Right way, wrong way, where am I? Any buttons, thingamabobbers? I think the pseudotogs are actually attacking the dude. Reload faster, please. Oh shit, oh! This is awkward. Holy crap! Now is not the time! Oh, for the love of God. Uh, I think I need to use my grenade, and also I need to set it on auto. Okay, auto, grenade. Come on. Come on, you little fuckers. I don't even know where you came from. Blow myself up! That didn't do shit! Oh my god. Yeah, I, I think I'm shooting him and that's what's killing me. Okay. Uh, grenades are ineffective. Explosions are not a valid means of killing flesh-based life forms. Loud noises. I'm just going to keep going forwards. Button, door, nope, keep going. Yeah, they're actually attacking him, okay. Doesn't bother me none. He's a distraction. Oh. Okay. Right, well, I guess maybe it's not just me that needs to... If I shoot him, uh, it hurts myself, but if he gets attacked, it also hurts myself. 
since he's attacked, uh, attached to me or something. I guess I need to defend him. If I get near him, he's gonna fuck with my mind, though. I'm gonna try to get past him. Are they just not coming anymore? Okay, they just went away. Don't worry, green man, everything's good. I think I hear them. No, I don't. Okay, long hallway or place with a disturbing anomaly thing in it. Let's go down the long hallway. I really wish I could sprint. Yeah, as soon as I'm done with this lab, I am going to get the upgrade, assuming it even exists. I really, really hope it does. What's up here? This guy's so annoying. This looks promising. Thingies. Science thingies. I like science thingies. Computer thingy? Ooh. Ooh. Hmm? Gobbledygook. When you obtain the case, don't bring it to me. Get it to barkeep. <laughs> if you assholes drink all the vodka again, you'll be severely punished. I think I read this before, but from someone else? I don't even know. Is there anything here new? Just a guide on how to get through anomalies and stuff. I don't think any of this matters. To all appearances, the fighters in the former Agropom Institute building have found something. I'm sure it is somehow related to the center of the zone. I feel like I've heard that before. When you obtain the cave. Alright. Well. I'm just gonna mashing F on everything. Hi. Oh my god, that just sprayed blood everywhere. Alright, get through a security system is still my quest. Oh my god, can you please get up the stairs? Thank you. Are you serious? I can barely walk upstairs. That is embarrassing. Oh shit. Hi. Uh, I can't even read that. Probably says, in case of fire, go through the stairs. This is like the world's most awkward chase sequence. This is... <laughs> this is not going well. Let's keep going up. Please open door. This door doesn't even open! Are you... You're just gonna block me in, aren't you? Are you... Okay. Yeah, well... 
This is going horribly. Right, here's what I'm going to do. Here, bleh, let me try that again. Here's what I'm going to do. I can't take any more of this. I just spent a half hour running around to buy a suit that makes it so I can't run, and then I'm spending this time slowly walking through molasses away from some green dude who is annoying and traps me in a corner. I'm good. I'm going to call it a day. Uh, before the start of the next episode, I am going to... Either figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do, or maybe just load a save game from before I did any of that and just go get the upgrade to be able to run right away. I don't know. But, uh, this is really annoying. Oh god, what have I done? What have I done? If I never see another lab in my life, I will be very, very happy. Alright, well, I hope you enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon, hopefully, in, uh, upgraded suit where I can actually run.